Chicken in the City, written by Maria Fleming, illustrated by Kelly Kennedy. Lulu the chicken lived on a farm, but life in the country was losing its charm. This book has a lot of nouns in it. Do you know what a noun is? Day after day, Lulu saw the same faces. She saw the same things. She saw the same places. Nouns are words that name people, animals, places, and things. Look at the picture. Which nouns name people and animals? Which name places? Which name things? Barn, farmer, tractor, corn. Horse, girl, field, chicken, fence. Cows, pond, ducks. Lulu said to herself, I need something new. I'll move to the city. That's what I'll do. So she packed up her suitcase one day in the spring and off Lulu went with a wave of her wing. In the city, Lulu saw new things galore. This page shows a lot of nouns that name things. Quick, look around your room. How many naming nouns can you list in two minutes? Camera, pretzel, stoplight, crosswalk, umbrella, taxi, bus, hairdo, hat. She visited places she'd never been before. This page shows a lot of nouns that name places. Can you think of 10 more nouns that name places you might visit? Museum, zoo, amusement park, cafe, fire station, planetarium. She saw lots of new people and animals too. Even some of Lulu's feelings were new. This page shows a lot of nouns that name people and animals. Can you think of nouns from A to Z? that name people or animals? For example, A is for acrobat, B is for bug, and so on. Vendor, musician, dogs, pigeons, juggler, cyclist, police officer. She felt delight and excitement, wonder and awe at each new astonishing sight that she saw. But there was one other feeling Lulu also detected, a feeling this chicken hadn't expected. Loneliness. She missed her friends on the farm. Now life in the city was losing its charm. Some nouns name things you can't see or touch, like feelings or ideas. Delight, excitement, wonder, awe, loneliness, life, and charm are all nouns. Can you think of other nouns that name feelings or ideas? I guess I'm just a country chicken at heart, Lulu said to herself as she prepared to depart. She repacked her bags and caught the next bus back home so she wouldn't have to spend her days all alone. At the farm, Lulu's friends held a big celebration and welcomed her back without hesitation. Lulu was happy to see all the old faces, all the old things, all the old places. Look at the picture now. How many nouns can you name? Remember, nouns name people, animals, places, and things. Can you come up with 15 nouns, or 25 nouns, or more? And she said to herself that night in her nest, new can be nice, but old is the best. Let's review. A noun is a word that names a person, animal, place, or thing. Some nouns name general people, animals, places, and things, like police officer, chicken, city, and suitcase. A noun can also be a specific name, like Lulu. This type of noun always begins with a capital letter. Some nouns name things you can't see, hear, smell, taste, or touch. Excitement, charm, and life are nouns that names feelings and ideas. How do you know if a word is a noun? Try putting a, an, or the in front of the word and using it in a sentence. Does this make sense? The chicken lived on a farm makes sense. Chicken and farm are both nouns.